And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the San Francisco Giants and the Texas Rangers. Joined by my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm John Shaw. Bo Bichette up to the dish. Singing, he's a guy that covers both sides of the plate about as well as anyone in the sport. How difficult is that to do? Well, just look at the back of my bubblegum card. You'll see how hard it is. These guys are great, man. They have the ability to look out there, but also to be able to turn on the inside pitch. Those that can really sharpen things on the outer half, those are the ones that become elite. Line drive, base hit. Joey gets on base and keeps it going. A lot of hitters tell that themselves, guy. line drive over the, the right infielder's right head. That's what I'm trying to do. Feet. Just keep that approach. Taylor Swift stepping in for the Rangers. In the air, right field. Solaire pulls it down, and that's the third out. Back in Arlington, and now the center fielder, Luis Matos. He has consistently been one of the best in the sport against lefties, and yet the righties give him trouble. You know, you don't want to be labeled as that guy, but the numbers say what they say. Well, he's a good player, but if he wants to be great, he's going to have to figure it out against right-handed pitchers. There's so many right-handers in the game that you're going to see him one after another. So you would imagine with that many looks, Bird, that the adjustment's got to be coming soon. Line drive, base hit. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. That ups her hitting streak to lucky number 13. The Baker's dozen boog, and it doesn't seem like a huge number, but anytime you get to the point where you've hit in every game for almost two weeks straight, uh, that's a sign of what kind of rhythm you're in. First and second, no outs. Next up for Texas, Nathaniel Lowe. Seeger over at second. Swift at first with no outs. Got him swinging on the curveball, and that is a big first out. Man, I really like the ability to bounce back right there after not getting the call. I don't think he should have gotten him. He didn't let it affect his focus, and he came back with another good pitch to get him swinging. Two on, one out. Popped up left side, and the infield fly is called. Now that second base is Ezekiel. Ezekiel Duran stepping in for the Rangers. Righty delivers. Hit weakly on the ground. Estrada whips it to first on the run. That ends the inning, and they limit the damage. Two men left stranded, but they do push across one. We're headed to the fifth, all tied 1-1. The center, the center fielder, fielder number 13. You know her great speed is in the back of that pitcher's mind. If she can get on, it's going to give him one more thing he's got to think about. In the air, right field. Pretty well struck back there. Oh, that ball was a rush. That'll fire up the dugout, and they add to their lead. It's 3-1. And that's her fifth straight game leaving the yard. And Boog, if she goes a game or two without hitting a home run, she's going to feel like she's going to get sit down to the minor leagues. That's great confidence in the power right there. Most hitters would try to hook that ball to the pull side and hit it out of the park. She stayed. Luis Matos, the next giant to hit. Now that, that, the Tying run at the plate. And that one is lifted in the air. Swift drifts towards it. Makes the grab. Runner tags at second. Here comes the throw. And he's out. Cut 
down, and that ends the inning. Exciting play and a great throw to third for the double play, but man, there's just no reason to try to move up to third right there. Not great base running to end the inning. So next to hit for Texas, Taylor Swift. She's already homered in this game. Ripped on a line to center. Machos pulls that one down, and that'll do it. One run, a pair of hits. He's done it again, Berg. That's his 30th save of the year as he puts another game to bed. Sweet dreams, everyone.